Hey everyone, welcome. Um, I'm here to introduce my bro, uh, Bastian Coves from uh, Bastian Alley Knives. Welcome. Thank you, bro. Yes, uh, as everybody knows, we're getting prepared for Blade Show and we have a very exciting collaboration. You know, a lot of you know uh, we've been working with Bastian over the years. Um, some very successful pieces and um, it's always been super exciting to birth neat new ideas <laughs> Uh, like I was stating before, you know, everything that you design, you know, has a has a, a, an extreme purpose, and uh, this one that we have has uh, no exception to the rule. So um, it's going to be really exciting to talk about this particular piece. You know, a few, I think it was maybe three weeks ago. Uh, yeah, yeah. I think three weeks ago you had said, "Hey, Tony, maybe we do a little something different." You know, a spin on the, um, you know, the B has been extremely popular for us. It still is, and. Um, so basically you had mentioned maybe doing an XL size or yeah. something a little bit bigger. And then when we started taking a look at it, you know, we're like, well, well, maybe I put a little bit of my DNA on this bitch. Kelly. And uh, I'm, I'm thinking, I'm thinking what we came up with is pretty, pretty exciting. But um, the new knife will be debuted at the Blade Show in mm -hmm. Atlanta. Yeah. And, um, but you'll get an opportunity to uh, uh, see a little bit of a sneak peek here. You know, you know, the unfortunate thing is, is we pulled this project together rather quickly, but, um, you know, heat treats, getting stuff cut, getting stuff, uh, you know, situated, it's, it's always kind of a, kind of a little bit of a free for all. So we lost a little bit of momentum over the last couple of days, but uh, nevertheless, we gained today in a huge way. Uh, we hustled up on the on the wheels and uh, and we were able to get some get some good stuff coming. But um, so the, the the new knife uh, we agreed is called the hypnotic. So um, yeah. uh, that's what we're gonna you know use the name as of right now in process. But um, I'll let uh, Bastian explain his concept behind this. And we kind so, of go from there. But, uh, and again, we thank Ben at uh, Chattanooga Leather Works for, yeah. I mean, getting these sheets done in a hurry for us. So thank you, Ben. We appreciate you, brother. Looking forward to seeing you at the show. I see, I, I owe you a bourbon or two for sure. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, Ben make an incredible job on this, uh, on this sheath like he, he, like he always do. Um, so um, for the sheath, we use um, the Ulti Clip uh, and like a traditional carry and like this you can put the blade in right hand or left hand like you can see uh, the design talk about the traditional push dagger so it's a very simple utilization at the moment when you grip the blade like this and you punch you have a very nice and elegant blade in yeah. your hand it can be different kind of size but uh, for this edition with Tony we decided to make something a little bit bigger than the B. <laughs> um, Oi. Yeah, so the, the idea at the beginning was like to make the B uh, XL. Um, that yeah. was the first conversation we have. And um, I remember that. And when I came a few weeks ago, um, you um, you just put the same, exactly the same uh, kind of design for the for the handle. And after you put your own, um, I don't know if I can show that on a video, but you put your own DNA dagger design. Oh, Everybody yeah. recognize the, the That's Microtech. definitely my Kung Fu. Yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. So that is clearly the design of the Microtech. So the, the fact we can mix this line on the push dagger and with exactly the same feeling and, and design than the B, that is pretty cool. So that everything matched perfectly. The comfort is really incredible. It's really light. I like it. And yeah, it's not to make toast, like we say. <laughs> it's not to make toast. <laughs> yeah. I love that. So we're going to make this one in different finition. Uh, yeah. Like uh, we start, that is the first, um, the first one get out of the, of the office today and uh, full custom. So that is pretty cool. And uh, yeah, the size is pretty big and it's really light. And like I said, like yeah, with the sheath just like this, yeah, you have a possibility to be right cool. hand and left yes. hand. Yeah. Yes, I like that. Whether it clips to a boot or anything, anything yeah. along those lines. Appendix. Yeah, you know. that particular type of uh, clip, I like it because it's extremely sturdy. Oh yeah, and nothing like going to pull something up and it either comes loose or anything along those lines. So I think it's, uh, I think it was well thought out. This simple, one is, this one is G10 and uh, you already prepared some carbon under. Yes, yeah, some, uh, yeah, some carbon fiber and also some beta titanium scales. We wanted to yeah. get a world just oh, to yeah. kind of see. So we'll have a couple different configurations 
you know, God willing for the show. So, you know, I'm just going to have to hustle up between now and Blade Show. But uh, I'm really excited about this piece. And we've also decided to, um, I believe, incorporate that into a microtech production build as well. So, yeah. Yeah. you know, hopefully, uh, you know, over the summer we'll have uh, a production version because that's just super hot. I really dig that. That's going to follow a little bit the line mm -hmm. of what we already do with the... Yeah with the B, but if some people need something a little bit bigger and with different kind of, you know, identity and DNA. And sure. on this one, we already like, I think it's a perfect match about really your signature and what we're doing since, since you've been the past Absolutely. now. Yeah. Because it's really, really nice to see this configuration like this. I think it's a perfect example mm -hmm. to show like, we, we are not done to mix different kind of stuff to see, <laughs> to see what's going on. So that is pretty cool. Yeah, and we're going to rock that uh, in M390. Yeah. So that's 190 thick, uh, 100, uh, 190 thousandths thick uh, M390. I'm really happy about that. And, you know, maybe if we do a couple of uh, uh, special collaboration, maybe we could do a little something with, uh, you know, maybe some something really slick from Baker Forge or something like that would look super sexy in a build. That would be so awesome. that's what I would be, uh, think about a configuration like that. I was talking to Quay, you know, when I told the guys about the dagger, it's like, oh man, we could definitely make something. You know, and since it's a, you know, uh, irregular shape, the guys would forge something that would flow with the piece a little bit more. So I'd be very curious to see what the guys can come up with as far as a, uh, you know, a, um, you know, San Mai or something that would flow really nice as far as, you know, not only be beautiful and elegant, but uh, very, very, very strong and very tough. Oh, yeah. You know, so we'd, um, you yeah, know, be curious to see how that uh, configuration will come along. But, um, no, we're excited about this. We're excited about Blade Show. It's going to be a lot of tough works between now and then, but uh, is lots of you know, stress, it's always it like anything else, you know. But um, you know, it's been it's been great having you here for the second round uh, again. You know, you came in the first time, yeah. worked on the design parameters, we worked on three D models, yeah. You know, and because the biggest thing is, I can you know you can anybody can get a. Uh, a product and scale it up or scale it back but there was a little bit more dynamic uh, to get the thing in your hand and for you to massage certain areas and tweak certain areas for it to be a little bit more ergonomic not just make get your original b and just make it bigger no no you know so you guys had to change some radius you had to change some other things the angles uh it was thought out. I like the way that you uh, you went about it. Yeah. You know, making a few, even the the 3D models that you guys did. You know, printing them off and then making changes. Even the first blade, I think I did was too big. You know, and uh, yeah, but and we're then, gonna we're gonna make yeah. some addition with this big one. I uh, think so. Yeah, yeah it'd be yeah, kind of yeah. cool. Yeah. Now your, your your team and the work you made with your team, like on that, because people don't really pay attention about all the detail between the drawing and what's sure. going on in every yeah. step. So, so, so the team making an incredible job on everything. And uh, and now, yeah, that is a final step and we can already feel what's going on over there like yeah. on this project. So that is pretty cool. We're pretty excited about it. We're yeah. pretty excited. Well, I think it's going to be a home run, bro. So cheers to that. Thank cheers. you. So thank you. Everyone, stay tuned. Uh, we're going to have some really great uh, content coming your way. Stay tuned for Blade Show. Stay tuned uh, for the weeks to come. And uh, we'll see you very soon. So have a wonderful evening and welcome. Thank you. Thank, thank you, you, Bastian. Thank you so Appreciate much. Appreciate you, bro. Thank you, bro. Thanks. Thank you.